damn it, boy. I'm aka bands and this is support this TV. How about you do me a quick little favor and hit that like button for me? I appreciate all my supporters out there. Now let's talk about Memphis. Memphis is taking the fuck off right now. You know, I have not seen these many niggas getting put on in Memphis in a long time, man. You know, a lot of people don't really know or a lot of people don't really want to respect, but Hypnotize Minds, which was DJ Paul and Juicy J, they put on a lot of guys out of Memphis, man. A whole lot of guys. Too many for me to name. But they was always putting a lot of guys on, right? Then you got your Gotti who came out and ended up doing his thing or whatever. You know, 8-Ball, MJG. You know them guys right up. But now you got the next generation with Black Youngster and Young Dolph. These two guys don't like each other. These two guys don't get along because of, you know, your Gotti or whatever. You know what I'm saying? He pretty much the middle man. Dolph got an issue with Gotti. Black Youngster is riding with Gotti. You know what I'm saying? But these guys are changing lives out there, man. And I couldn't be more happier. So my advice to any artist out there in Memphis, keep grinding because right now the spotlight is on y'all. You know, everybody rather everybody in Memphis to get along, but sometimes it just don't work that way. But Black Youngster, you know, he just recently signed Young Money. You know, I put up a video about that and Young Money saying Black Youngster changed his life. You know, he put on Young Money, you know, um, you know, gave him the Aston Martin game all the money. Young Dolph put on Key Glock. Gay Key Glock like a drop top Mercedes. You know, I don't know what kind of Mercedes it is, but it's north of a hundred thousand, man. It's a Mercedes. It's not a BMW or, you know, Jag or whatever. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's a Benz. So, you know, it's north of a hundred thousand. You know, he got, um, Paper Rock J. Filzer, which a lot of people is telling me is Dolph Cousin. He don't put him on. You know, Filzer be riding around in the Jag or whatever. You know, ain't no telling what other whoops he probably pushing up in. You know, Dolph put on Bino. You know, being no probably whipping something real hard as well. And what I'm trying to say is this right here, man. These guys is, is changing lives. Like, they're actually getting put on they self. With Dolph, you know, he grind his way up, him and daddy yo, and, and got put his cell phone, basically. And Black Youngster got put on by um, Yo Gotti or whatever. But what I'm saying, these guys done went back to the hood and on reached in and picking guys up. And, I, and you know, and some are saying that these two are trying to compete with each other. They're trying to show that one got more money than the other. You know what I'm saying? The, the fact of the matter is that they out here changing lives and they giving these young guys money. They giving these young guys a platform. You know what I'm saying? They giving a lot of opportunities out there, which is good because sometimes when people make it out the hood, sometimes they don't usually come back that fast and go and get people out the hood. You can name so many famous rappers who don't came up and you never seen them bring nobody out the hood. I'll never put nobody on. These guys ain't even, well, the Young Dolph dropped an official album. Black Youngster ain't even dropped an official album yet, and he already passed not deals. You know what I'm saying? Um, young Dolph does sign an official record deal, and before that, he was putting out, you know, signing artists and giving them major money and stuff. So, these guys are putting on for their city, even though they are divided. They are here putting a lot of money in these young guys' pockets putting them in some nice cars. I hope they also teaching you guys fundamentals about saving and investing and watching the way they move. Cause you know, it's going to always be some savages, some goons out there. They're going to want to take something from me. One of the one of the young guys or whatever. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, if you in Memphis, take my advice, keep fucking grinding. Because if one of these guys don't put you on, the fact that the spotlight is on Memphis right now, that's going to help put you on. I'm making a bands and I'm out. Make sure you share, like, and subscribe. Comment in the comments below. I will come in and respond to you. I'm out.